this is real life and things happen I ended up um, running some errands having to braid my hair into like this little crown braid and I have to take it out now because I want to show you these Bantu knots I don't know if this is going to work because I only have a few hours it is now 4 18 p.m. you can't even see that but it's not 4 18 p.m. I'm going to attempt to do the Bantu knot, hoping for the same results as if I slept in them overnight. I'm going to do the Bantu knot and I have until about 7.30 because I have a Halloween party to go to at 8 o'clock, but probably just don't show up late. I'm always late anyway, so <laughs> um, yeah. Um, the goal now is to do the Bantu knot. I'm probably going to sit under a hooded dryer just to make sure that it sets and hopefully that works. Who knows, but we'll see. Also, look at my little cute little Starbucks cup that I got in Hawaii. This is not free promo for, oh, technically this is very, very free promo for them because I'm not paid for this. Anyway, let me stop talking and 
get the Bantu knots done. I wish I could stay, but the seasons are changing. Let's go. Um, first of all, make sure that your hair is parted where you want it to be parted. I usually like my parts on the side, so I've already done that after I blew it out. And I'm going to section my hair off into halves. Since it's been a few hours since I blew it out, it started to get matted up again. What I'm going to do is use the blow dryer to go through a bit, but I'm just going to keep it on warm. Just to help me detangle it a little bit more and to make sure that it's stretched before I do the Bantu, uh, Bantu twist. That's it. That's all I needed right now. Uh, just to make sure that it's like detangled and fluffy. And I will section. Again, it does not have to be perfect. I will section like this. And then I'll separate this into two. Start from the bottom. It is pretty well detangled because I just blew it out with the comb. And I did that for a reason. Like you want your hair to be as detangled as possible for like the smooth, bouncy curls. I am not using any additional products, but it will turn out nice. Fingers crossed, we'll see. But take the twist, separate half and half. Try not to borrow from the other half. It makes it easier to take down the hair. Two, let's keep twisting. wrap it around itself so what I do I start here wrap your finger around a little bit and then wrap it keep doing that to make sure it's tight again you don't want it to be super tight at the roots so I untwist it a bit when I feel like it's too tight at the root and then wrap it around itself wrap it around itself once again Keep going, keep going, and then you are done. I pull out the hairs because I'm not trying to lose any hair. And then You just wrap and you wrap and you wrap. Okay. And you repeat to the other side. My hands are moving in like fast speed because I need to be done. I have so much work to do tomorrow not today we're going to take a break today it's been a busy day but tomorrow i'm going to definitely be productive my goal is once november hits it's like crunch time making sure that i outline um, if you're not familiar with outlining for law school Basically, you take all the information that you have learned throughout the whole semester, you put it in an outline form that makes it easier to study, and then you can actually study from it to prepare for your exam. We are back. I am going to take these out. 
it's almost time for me to go so i need to hurry up um the only additional product that i'm going to use is this design essential silk essentials i put it on my hand to take out my twist some people use different types of oils this is just what i have right now so i put a little bit on my fingers and we will start unraveling please cross your fingers for me this is the first time that i've done a style in the same day and hoped for it to work so we'll see i'm gonna go very very slow twist around and we'll see how this turned out okay okay so that's one you can't really tell there we go okay so that's one maybe maybe okay you have to move gently so you don't start to cause frizz which is okay i don't necessarily mind my hair frizzing up but for like day one curls i want it to be a bit more smooth and then it can frizz later on throughout this week okay we get in somewhere two strands so I feel for where it naturally breaks which is right here and take it out do the same all over feel for where it naturally breaks which is right here in the middle this is why I said it was so important to not share the hair with itself I wish I could This is the first takedown. Here's how it looks without it being fluffed out. So now I'm gonna separate it again much more and I need like to actually pay attention trying to fluff this out. So I'll come back after I do it. But literally all I'm gonna do is just separate this a little bit more. Like I'm, I'm gonna show you a few of them. But all I'm gonna do is like grab it and just separate it a little bit more at a time, like that, okay? But I need the mirror, so I will come back very soon. <laughs> okay, so we are back. This is what it looks like now. Again, you will get better results if the twist were to stay in your hair longer. But for these to have only been in my hair, I finished doing my hair around like 5.30. It's now 7.57. I sat under the dryer for maybe 30 minutes or less than that. And I'm still able to have these curls. It's fluffy. All I'm gonna do is style it a bit. I wanted to do a bang but it's not really shaping how I wanted it to shape. So I'm gonna do a side part that I usually do. And I will be back again with my Halloween costume this time. We are back. Again, it's definitely way more fluffy and it looks more like day two or like a few days older. But yes. I'm all done, and I am actually going as Velma. 
I can keep my glasses on. Let's call a spade a spade, baby. We're going through phases. I wish I could stay, but the seasons are changing. It's cold. We're going through phases. I wish I could stay. Rise and shine, gotta get the day started, sun beaming in my face as the blessings keep falling.